Hi and good day. The SCN muscle, sternocleidomastoid. These muscles we rarely pay attention to. But if you notice when you turn your head to the side, you'll feel this real thick muscle stick out. Although due to faulty posture, pronated shoulders, forward head carriage, forward head posture, these muscles take a tremendous toll. Although they're very thick and very strong, they attach to the mastoid process of the temporal bone, make its way down attached to the manubrium of the sternum and the medial part of the collarbone or the clavicle. So as they make their way down, they branch off into the sternum and into the collarbone. Now you can actually feel this muscle when you turn your head. If you turn your head to the left, take your thumb and trace it down right above that inside of that collarbone and you'll feel that muscle come out. It, it comes out like a, like a sore thumb. You can stick your thumb right inside that muscle and you can feel where it's attaching. Now, this is what we want to do. We want to hold a specific point on that insertion by causing a neuromuscular reflex, a neuromuscular type of reflex called proprioceptive neural muscular facilitation. This type of facilitation, we are going to cause a reflex from that point to the brain, the brain back to the muscle, and to allow the muscle to relax. Prolonged sitting at a computer, texting, looking down, poor posture, sitting in your vehicle with your head forward, or doing any other kind of activity, sewing, typing, whatever you may be doing, is causing excessive weakening within these muscles. The body will then compensate. It will cause the muscles to contract, over fatiguing the muscles, irritating the nerves, and causing other muscles to compensate as well. So it's very important that when these muscles cramp down, when they're contracted, and you're gonna say, how, are they, how do I know they're contracted? Well, right now, turn your head to the left and turn to the right. See if you can put your chin over your shoulder. If you notice you cannot, most likely these muscles are overly contracted. So what we're gonna do, we're going to uh, allow this muscle to relax by doing a little certain uh, method, little type of uh, procedure. This is the type of acupressure procedure we're gonna do. We're gonna contact uh, that lower part of the SEM. This is how we're gonna do it. I want you to turn your head to the left, take your thumb, go down right above the inside of the collarbone. You'll feel that little muscle stick out. I want you to take your thumb and I want you to push against that tendon where it's attaching right into that bone. Just hold it. Okay? You're going to push it the opposite direction and just hold it. Leave your head the way it is. You're going to hold it for 30 seconds. It's going to be a little painful, but after you hold it, we're sending a neural muscular uh, facilitative response to the brain back to the area. And as we hold it, the muscle will start to give. It will start to relax. You can do the other side the exact same way. You'll turn the opposite side. You'll take your thumb. You'll push right against that tendon where it's attaching down to the clavicle. And as you push it outwards, it's going to be a little sore. Hold it 30 seconds. And that should relate, release a lot of that SCM muscle from contracting. Now, it's a very uncomfortable type of procedure, but very, very effective because we're sending uh, sensory messages from the muscle back to the brain and we're sending motor messages back to the brain to the muscle to allow that muscle to relax naturally. Hopefully this will take away a lot of your pain, discomfort, as well as giving you that full range of motion. I'm sure you'll be grateful for that. Share this video, put your comments below. Most important, make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.